Yes. It's still. But you can't be any geek off the street. You gotta be handy with the steel if you know what I mean. Keep it real. Keep it real. Keeping it real. Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Steven and this is Steel Keeping It Real. So you know what today is. What we're gonna do right here is go back. Way back. Back into time. That's right. It is throw back Thursday and on this day I like to dig deep into the crates go back to the days of yesteryear and play you some classic hits now this next song is from 1986 and the song is from the boogie boys it is called dealing with life now there was a lot of other songs that I could do by the boogie boys I've already done girl talk and I could have done a fly girl Oh, and I could have done You Ain't Fresh, or I could have done Run It, but there's not a lot of music videos for the Boogie Boys, and that is a shame. And there is a video for Dealing With Life. Now, this song didn't chart, but in my neighborhood, and the fact that they made a video that was on, you know, Video Soul or Late Night, whatever, you know, video program that they had during the time that would play hip-hop videos, they used to play it a lot. Now, here's the other weird thing. I went to try to look for the lyrics for Dealing With Life, and I can't find them anywhere. And that is a shame. 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 It's a real shame. But as far as I remember, this is a good song. Uh, the Boogie Boys were one of the innovators of using synthesizers uh, like the Synclavier, uh, Fairlight emulator, and the DKI Synergy synthesizer. And so, you know, a lot of people have sampled the Boogie Boys, uh, but the Boogie Boys didn't do a lot of sampling. <clears throat> when you listen to, you know, this particular song, realizing that they've created every single element themselves. Um, there isn't like, you know, a, a record that's being interpolated in there or, or anything. They did this all themselves. Now, I loved the Boogie Boys because in 1986, I would have been, depending on if it's later on in the year, uh, this would have been, uh, I would have been a senior in high school if it was September uh until the end of the year. If it was earlier than that, it was May before I was a junior in high school. So this is like me on a plate, you know, listening to the Boogie Boys. This is me in my bedroom with my, my keyboard at the time, a Casio CZ5000, just creating music. And this is one of the influences to me uh, during that time period. Now, if you like videos like this and others on the channel, please don't forget to hit the like button, the subscribe button, and the notification button, because I'm do doing at least 15 videos each and every week. So, without any further ado, here are the Boogie Boys and Dealing With Life. The 
been chosen for bad delivery. Too many problems for me to be lucky. And if I keep this pace, I'm bound to die bucket. I wake up in the morning, and then I look around. I think about life, I want to lay back down. Then I hear a little voice from way inside. They get your butt out of bed. Man, you gotta survive. When I stop to think about it, I feel like a jerk. Cause everything I got, I got from hard work. People dealing with guns, and dealing with knives. Even dealing with drugs, but never dealing with life. Sometimes I say, oh, I'm just forgetting. Life's too rough and I just ain't with it But the little boy says when things go wrong Man, you gotta keep on, keep on Keep on, keep on Dealing with Life by the Boogie Boys, and I guess that program or that video program was called Rock America. Um, you know, that one goes out to Shadow, uh, somebody who uh, needs, you know, some support and some uh, just prayers and, you know, life is rough. You gotta wake up every morning, you know, thank your higher power for the breath in your lungs and just try to try to make it through another day day by day and you know it you know if, if it wasn't for certain people in my life i don't know where i would be so i i thank my higher power for what i do have and um and that's all i had to say about that if you are still here, I thank you very much for staying tuned. I really do appreciate it. First and foremost, I want you guys to like the videos as much as I like making them for you. After that, all you need to do to help me out with the channel is to like, subscribe, share, and comment. Peace.